Hey Virgo, welcome to Good Witch Intuitive Tarot. Thank you guys for liking, sharing, and subscribing. I do appreciate it. This is going to be your reading for um, the upcoming, for, for August, the whole month of August. Um, for anyone that is guided to see it, whenever they're guided to see it, um, this could resonate any day, week, month, or year. We put these dates on them for the people that like to keep track of the dates. And for those of you that like to follow them, you know, for each month to month. But this could resonate at any time, actually. Um, but it's for Virgo. Anyone with Virgo placements, um, anyone who's guided here to watch it, it's for anyone who is guided. Oh, hold on. You got three of them, so I'm not going to pull the bottom card. We're going to stick with the three we got. Oh, I love this one. This is probably one of my favorite cards in this deck. It may well be my favorite card in this deck. A leg up. Higher power. Happy, happy. This is beautiful energy. So this leg up could be coming from Spirit God Universe. But look, look at the third eye. It's like a keyhole here beautiful so the key to this is also to listen to your intuition um you're being given a leg up i swear i feel like spirit sending you information that is your leg up that's going to send you to happiness so pay close attention to whatever it is you're being guided towards here um let's get a few cards so this is witch's tarot we're going to start there this was wisdom of the oracle i'm sorry and we're going to clarify with um Gilded Royale. Now, I did it the opposite for everyone else, but for some reason I'm using this one first for you. So we'll see what happens. There must be a reason why I'm doing it this way. Um, Spirit and Angels, anyone for the highest good? What do we need to know for Virgo? Anyone with Virgo placements? What are the messages here for the collective, for anyone who's guided? What are the most important messages we have for anyone who's guided here to watch this reading on YouTube? Please allow me to connect with as many people as possible. Please allow me to deliver the most important messages people need to hear as accurately as possible. We have a leg up, higher power, and happy, happy for anyone with Virgo placements or anyone else who's guided for the month of August 2021 or whenever they're guided to see this reading. All right, let's do it. A leg up, higher power, happy, happy. What else do we need to know? Whoa, everything keeps landing in my lap today. <laughs> All right, what else? Virgo reading. What else do we need to know? Virgo reading. Oh, the shadow side reverse. That's a double reverse. Excellent. So if you were in some kind of really weird stuck energy or something, you're getting released from that. Um, what? this is a lot i'm gonna put them all back because there's so many of them i'd love to keep them but i'm not going to all right just one or two what else do we need to know virgo reading the hanged man shadow side in reverse we have a leg up higher power and happy happy what else do we need to know about this Okay, we keep getting a lot that are popping out. And what's really weird, something else flipped right away in there. And that was that one. Okay, let's look at this. You've got here, you're in the upright, but your mother, mother-in-law, ex-wife, somebody here is not. Okay, and this is very karmic. So you might have a karmic relationship with your mother. It happens all the time. Don't freak out. Um, this could be a karmic relationship with your ex-wife. This could be baby mama. This could be whatever it is. It's, it's somebody. You've got some kind of, I feel, very karmic relationship here um, with somebody. It Could it be, you know, the person, you know, your boyfriend is married or was married to ex-wife drama this could be a grandmother an aunt it could be anybody anybody i mean it, anybody it could be a boss all right so i want to look at the back energy here real quick because um all right yeah i don't want to get all into this i don't let's just look at the three i mean i'm sorry the six i don't know why i said three but the six of cups here it is reversed this could have been an unjust unhappy past and i'm saying that because well we've got the wheel here reversed the karmic wheel reversed we have justice reversed and we have the past reversed did you go through something where you were attacked 
by someone who did something very unjust and unfair to you if you did the divine's got your back here with temperance and i didn't want to get into all this but here i go getting into all this but quick note that whatever this is there's like some kind of karmic thing from the past i feel you're getting a leg up higher powers here and happy happy is coming your way like i said you look amazing queen of pentacles you've got this karma right between you and this other woman the empress reverse you will know who she is no doubt about it because this woman is a pain in your ass we've got here um the hanged person or the hanged man we've got the shadow side more karma here but we're releasing from the devil okay and we have got the four of wands in reverse this person caused your whole entire home your family your children your husband your whoever everybody everybody to be unhappy because she's evil okay i'm sorry she's evil all right let's get into it spirit and angels anyone for the highest good what do we need to know about this reading for virgo anyone with virgo placements now virgo if you're let's just say you're a masculine or a woman who's into women you might be um dealing with the reality of a woman who's extremely karmic to you um you know whether you're male or female i feel like this is so it's the same story really but um i just feel like it's the same either way we look at it all right spirit and angels anyone for the highest good what do we need to know about this Virgo reading what is what are the most important messages this woman definitely has something to do with your past your home your family your children her children something something about your your husband your boyfriend or this is your mother or your childhood i mean whatever this is this woman has been very karmic to you probably for many 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 years all right what do we need to know virgo reading very important a leg up higher power and happy happy what is the universe bestowing on virgo to put an end to this wretched woman <laughs> <laughs> all right sorry virgo i just get it. i'm getting into your reading here virgo tell me about the hanged man what do we need to know hanged man seven of pentacles waiting and waiting and waiting for what what are you waiting for this is a lot of waiting around for something okay so we planted some seeds and now we're waiting for growth so you're waiting to see something come of something all right, what about this? Uh, the, now, this might not be you. This could be them. And what is going on here? Tell me about the shadow side reversed. What do we need to know? This is the devil reversed. Oh, you're coming out of it. Excellent. So we have here the five of chalices reversed, where we're coming out of a time of a lot of grief. This is the grieving card. This is going through a lot of sad. And this person's really been hurt. Look at them. They are in the deepest depths of sorrow. We're coming out of it. Um, this person has really hurt you, whatever they did. Tell me about the Four of Wands reversed. What do we need to know about the Four of Wands in the reverse? This is like lack of peace to me. Yeah, seven of wands reverse. You felt like you couldn't even defend yourself in your own home, in your own family, in your own life. Tell me about the empress reversed. What do we need to know about the empress and the reverse? You, Some of you might have had to move because of this woman. Tell me about the empress reversed. Yeah, Ten of Wands reversed. So you're dumping this burden. So there's something happening that's going to help you dump the burdens with this woman. And it's going to be great news that comes in. Ding dong, the wicked witch is dead. That's what I'm hearing in my mind. That's so sad, but it's so true. All right. So, I, I mean, but look at this. This has been so, so unhappy. Whatever this news is, it's going to come in like a tower moment, but in the reverse. I don't think it's going to be painful for you. 
It's going to be the death card. It's going to put an end to what? Whatever happened here in this past that was so unhappy had to do with your home, your family, where you felt destitute, lost, lonely, sad, left out in the cold, heartbreak, all of this. There's some kind of good news coming in. This is all sitting right at the bottom of this deck. This good news is going to allow you to dump these burdens surrounding this woman, whatever it is. Tell me about karma. Karma, karma. I Now listen. When I always feel when somebody is getting abused and abused and abused and abused for years, it's very karmic, very karmic. So if you're in an abusive relationship, there's something you need to learn. And most of the time, what it is, we need to learn how to be treated better, to want more for ourselves, to walk away and pull that plug on these karmic people to, you know, uh, not engage with them anymore. Not, And I know it's hard, especially if it's a family member. It's very hard. But there's still something you need to learn about how we teach people how to treat us. And if we are going to keep saying, oh, yeah, I'm going to stay and let you keep, you know, abusing me, then you're going to keep getting abused. But for someone here, this could have been that someone that's abused you since you were too young to know any better. And that's the sad part of this. So let's look at this karma because I feel I feel spirit, God, universe will reward you greatly for putting up with that kind of abuse. Tell me about karma. What do we need to know? Especially if you've risen yourself out of this being abused into a higher powered being because of it. If you took that abuse and that treachery that you went through and used it to help other people, used it for the good of other people, used it to never harm another soul to be so much better than that. You used it to spur you into being the, the complete opposite of this person. I swear you get rewarded big time for that. Tell me about karma. What about karma? Because a lot of abusers go on to abuse. And that's unfortunate. It's learned behavior, right? But the ones who don't, mm, good karma comes your way. Tell me about this karma card. What do we need to know about karma? Yeah, Queen of Swords reversed and the Knight of Pentacles reversed. So we've got very, very slow, something coming in very slowly. And I think it's clarity that's coming in really slowly. So you're going to get some kind of clarity on this. Look, the hanged man put himself in a... In a Hanged man puts themselves in an uncomfortable position to see things from another perspective and to get enlightened about things, to get the information they need, to see something clearly. I feel like you will see a victory here with the Six of Wands right there. You're going to see it. You're just not seeing it yet because it's karma. It's got a, It's about divine timing. Something's coming in that you're going to see. There's some kind of victory here for you that you will see on the other side of this. Um, tell me more about, tell me about the queen of pentacles. This is your energy. Tell me about this. Whoa, get back here. It's way too many. All right. Tell me all about the queen of pentacles. What do we need to know about queen of pentacles? Virgo reading. Queen of pentacles. What's important? King of Cups reversed. Ooh. Did you deal with an emotional manipulator? Tell me about why is the King of Cups reversed showing up on the Queen of Pentacles? This could have just been, oh, it was emotionally draining and painful. This was so much pain in your relationship, look, or in your home, in your family. It just caused, this King of Cups is an emotional drain. Um, and it has to do with this broken heart. It has to do with whatever happened. This There was so much sadness in your home, in your family, whatever this was. Tell me more about Queen of Pentacles. What do we need to know about her? Other than the fact that she has survived all this, what do we need to know about her? Anything? Is there anything important we should know? No, just one. That's too many. Anything important we should know about Queen of Pentacles, please? One or two cards. magician whoa what are we manifesting queen of pentacles this is the virgo for sure 
So this is Spirit's way of saying you are the Queen of Pentacles. You are manifesting something here. What is this we're manifesting? This something happened and uh, the come out about this person i feel tell me what is the magician doing here with the queen of pentacles what do we need to know here what is manifesting here or what's happening here so you've got all the tools you need for what what is this about the past to deal with this past situation and the person that was a bully i kid you not high priestess at the bottom as well wow dealing with the fighting the arguing the bickering it's over it's done judgment in reverse you're not going to have to deal with this ever again and why because there's something about you having all the tools you need to stop whatever this is I got to go back to her, to this Empress reversed. And how are you getting Ten of Wands reversed? Tell me about Ten of Wands reversed. How are you dumping these burdens? <coughs> Ace of Wands. I tell people all the time, I swear to you, Spirit, Spirit does this purposefully to me all the time. And I thank you, Spirit. I continually, no matter what deck I use, no matter what, even if it's after tarot, I continually get the Ace of, I mean, I'm sorry, the Ten of Wands reversed with the ace of wands just to show what happens or sometimes it's in the upright but it still comes out like this i get them together so that i can explain to you that these burdens are going away and you're getting a brand new beginning you dump those burdens and you get the new beginning so whatever this is you've got all the tools you need to deal with this bully whatever this is and i don't know what exactly this is but you guys have got to tell me this has been so draining for you. You have waited so long to stop whatever this is. And you're about to have your wishes come true. You really are. This is like finally long overdue justice. God, thank you, right? Boy, I can, I can actually relate to this reading. <laughs> um, let's get into this. My God. Oh, wow absolutely look at this the five of swords overcoming the bully these just flipped over i haven't even asked a question yet overcoming the bully this person was a bully a horrible horrible bully spirit and angels anyone for the highest good what do we need to know about this reading please what do we need to know what comes next here for anyone that will resonate with it what comes next oh come on oh my god this was all what just flipped out. Somebody getting caught in a trap. Needing to release something. Maybe even money. Did this person take money from you? Look at this. Fives everywhere. You have fives everywhere. You are coming out of this. This is changing. Your life is going to change. I promise you. My God. Tell me more. Tell me more about what comes next here for whoever is resonating with this reading clarity is coming in there's a queen of swords again you are getting something this slow clarity coming in about this karma is coming for you when it comes in it's like you finally get your clarity you might even get pentacles someone might have that pentacle reversed that's coming in you're going to get the truth about what happened with it tell me more about this i need to know more anything else about wait just one or two anything else about whatever this is we need to know about in this situation what is being released here with the four of swords like spirits making see when this card shows up i promise you if this person doesn't release this is when we get a tower moment where spirit makes it somebody's getting caught tell me something about this four of pentacles and seven of swords yeah nine pentacles i'm telling you oh my gosh it's ten pentacles Ten pentacles flipped over too. There's something. You're going to get some kind of information here. Whoever this horrible, wretched person is took from you, left you out in the cold. Oh, man. There's information coming out. You guys have got to let me know. I'm like, I'm like, oh, my gosh. This person is, I want to say this is either someone's like i want to say like baby mama let me get one more card on that empress 
Give me anything you can on who this Empress is, Empress Reversed. What? Who is this person? What do we need to know about her? Anything at all. What is it that Spirit wants us to know about her? She's from the past and you're going to move away from her and have peace. You've moved from the fives to the sixes. I knew it. I knew it. These are both sixes. Six of pentacles, six of swords. Spirit wants you to know that you are now moving away from this person. You're not going to deal with this person anymore. You're leaving her in the past. You're leaving whatever she did to you in the past. You're moving away from all. There's sixes everywhere here. You're moving away from, there's fives everywhere. And when I see all these fives and after tarot, especially, or when I see them reversed, I know that you're leaving them in the past. This is definitely coming to closure here for you. And I feel like you're going to, something's happening with this person. They're going to have to release something to you. I don't know. I mean, if this person abused you enough, you might be suing them. I have to say that. I don't see that here, but I see this person paying you something. Okay, whether they owe it to you, whether they took it, whether they stole it, whatever it is, this is somebody's like, this is somebody who caused a lot of pain, a lot of pain to you. I hope this makes sense to somebody. Okay, let's get you a couple of angel cards here. Angels for Virgo, what do we need to know about this reading? This would have been that bully that just never let your family have peace. That's what this would have been. Give me one more. Beauty. Wow, beautiful. Wow, responsibility. Yep. I'm telling you, someone's going to have to take responsibility for never letting your family have peace. Responsibility. Openness. Somebody's going to come in and tell you something. I'm telling you, you're getting quick information about this and clarity. Oh. Quick information about this. Clarity is coming in everywhere about this. Beautiful. You are going to love this because your life is never going to be hurt by this horrible person again. And the spirit says, we're giving you a leg up. We're sending you information. This could even be intuitive information that you get, but it helps you do something in this physical world. Happy, happy. You're going to love this. Beauty, happy, happy. Anyway, guys, please comment down below. I want to know who this wretched, horrible person is. And those of you that want to say this is a man, it's a man then, whatever. If you want to call the empress a man, do it all day long. I call the empress a woman. I always will. And I'll always call the emperor a man. Anybody else I can flip-flop with. But um, for me, this is a wretched, horrible baby mama, ex-wife, mother, stepmother, aunt, grandmother, someone who's abusive, someone who um, caused a lot of trauma, drama, and pain. This would have been a bully. This person came out five of swords twice. Bully, bully, bully. Anyway, so you will, and this is someone from the past. This is someone who might have abused you, your family for years. You're going to get some kind of information about this. Hey, for all I know, this person is dying and leaving you a bundle and the spirit said we had to get her out of your life one way or another and I'm sorry that it comes out that way but it, that's the way I'm seeing it that spirit does something to cause this woman to not be able to harm you ever again I feel like she gets caught doing something like trying to harm you again you know leave me alone you may have moved to get away from this person and she's still stalking you and following you you guys got to let me know please fill me in please like share subscribe this is a very specific reading i know for very specific people um i hope you enjoyed it i hope that somebody here resonates with it it's going to be very specific like i said but spirits got your back and who knows there might even be a human who has your back it's a leg up higher power happy happy a lot of times spirit the higher power sends people to you that are in your highest good that are going to help you all right guys i hope you enjoyed it please like share subscribe and if you need a personal reading my information is directly beneath this video in the description area don't forget you have all the tools you need to end this situation once and for all if you need a personal reading my information is directly beneath this video 
in the description area. If you don't see the price of the reading, my PayPal link, my email address, and some other information, you have to tap on something on your screen. It depends on what device you're watching YouTube on. Okay, guys, have a good one. I'll talk to you soon. Have a great month. Bye.